you're still here, I find that very reassuring. Uh, we're in for some more of Poet the Poet here, but for a little variety, we have not only a poet, but a musician, all rolled into one package, and that's Ad Ogieri. And as I said, he is a uh, beatnik prototype for the 21st century. You can tell by the costume. Very nice threads. Uh, and you must give me a note to your tailor sometime. Um, it's he, my clothes. Ah, it's your clothes. It's not that my does costume. it all yourself, too. My costumes look more like Bozo, remember? The old oh, Bozo yes, from the Bo 60s. Those are my costumes. When you see me dress like that, that's a costume. Where do you see me dress as Lamarachi? <laughs> it's, uh, it's, you'll, you'll die. I'd like <laughs> to see that. <laughs> <laughs> well, it'll cost more. That's, um, anyway, you do have a tendency to wander around Greenwich Village with your guitar and your voice and your, uh, and your street clothes. <laughs> and yeah. uh, which uh, makes him very noticeable, but uh, he's n he's not what you hear about Greenwich Village. He's very Ed is a very nice guy and very talented and uh, all that. And uh, he hosts a show, believe it or not, in a place called Jane's Cafe. Uh, it's called the Free Music Show. It's in Thursdays. How'd you pull yeah. this one off? Well, uh, you know, we we felt that uh, there's a lot of places around town that were were charging. And uh, we wanted to give some music away. It's uh, you know, music could be very uh, a very uplifting thing. Uh, you know, a, an emotion mover. Mm -hmm. uh, and uh, we think that we should give some of it away at least. So you can come on uh -huh. down and just sit down and, and look and listen. I see. Does that mean you don't have the music doesn't have to come with a warranty? No <laughs> warranty. If you give it away. Oh, right. And uh, let's see. <laughs> You do radio, I understand. Uh, yeah, I do some uh, spots on BAI and uh, you know, uh, light show uh, with Fred Giebald. He uh, he really services the um, the scene, so to speak, uh, uh -huh. as to what's going on uh, in and around the city. And uh, you know, he'll he'll plug your gigs and he'll play your you know songs on the air there, which is really good because it's you know it's it's a local thing. You know. That's great. He services the scene, and I have a friend who services my car. <laughs> At any rate, um, maybe they're the same people. Ed, perhaps you'd better rescue us here with a little song. Okay. okay. This is called White Flags. <laughs> flags at the moment, but I could raise this white sheet of paper and maybe I can surrender that way. A napkin will do. Uh -huh. <laughs> what brought this one on? Uh, the, 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 I think the human need to, to, uh, to surrender, to surrender to what is good and uh, to give up what is bringing us down as a race, as a human race, and uh, surrender to what will bring us to our potential. Uh. All right, uh, I think we're ready for another song. 
both on of that you. one. Oh, all right. Oh yeah, you're you're working today. That's <laughs> there's, there's no getting around that. This is Americana Kingdom. Only in the potholes. <laughs> Only in the potholes, or at least the auto mechanics did. I've broken many an axle in my good. time. Ed, what makes you decide whether to go for the finger picking style on a song or for uh, one of these little doodads Pick here? Plectrums. Uh, yes, yes. Basically, I, I, pay, I play with a pick. Uh, that's what I'm comfortable with, the strumming kind of rhythm guitar stuff. Uh -huh. uh, once in a while, I'll, I'll you do some. Sometimes you pick finger some. style. Yeah, sometimes I'll do that. Uh, depend, depending on the mood of the song, if it's more quiet or it needs some uh, more intricate kind of uh, notes happening. Yeah. How so, long have you been playing? I've been playing since I'm wee. Ah. Wee. I'm not wee anymore. I didn't know you were French. <laughs> No, I was I was wondering how much uh, how much time and effort it takes to get to where you are at this. Uh... Well, you know, I, I guess uh, it, it could. I believe it could have been d done a lot quicker if the intensity was up there. Uh -huh. But you know, uh, things in in life happen, and uh, it took a long time for uh, me. <laughs> okay. Would you Would you care to get intense and uh, and dredge up another song for us? Eh? Okay. Okay, let's see what I can do for you. I think maybe I'll do top down. Well, I got one for you, but I'm going to detune a little bit. Uh-oh. Yeah, I'll just bring one of, one of my strings down a bit. And for those of you who are not musical, detune is an integral portion of the song. Duh. <laughs> Aren't you tuned yet? Okay. That sounds promising. That'll do it. This is called It's All Right.
say it was considerably more than all right. Thank you, Ed. Thank for you, being Robert. On, uh, for being on Poet to Poet and uh, My pleasure. Pluck, plucking a few strings here and there. And uh, I used to pluck chickens in my in my younger days. It helped me immensely with, with my own poetry. And uh, I had this awful temptation to put on one of mine and shatter the mood. And I think I'll do that. Uh, right. This one is called Rambling with Resumes. And um, it's the expurgated version. There's one that's a lot more, uh, a lot more uh, controversial, but this is a gentle one. Of all the disasters I ever courted, sending out my resume unescorted leaves the field and trumps the ace. Even millionaires and similar whatnots are getting displaced, what with the economy going the pot. So what chance do I think I've got? Time was when I scoff at layoff rumors until they started treating me like a tumor. And now the controller holds the ball, and now she lets it drop. And now my life is shattered by the force of Casey's chop. Well, I've been set on the road to an early grave. Six management positions have somehow been saved. Well, hooray. I think they call it controlling the damage. Still, I can type and I can file and steer, steer a coal barge down the Nile. It's all there on my resume and match. It boasts an itch for every scratch. Despite this, I wallow in a sea of truth, setting my poor soul on fire. You can lead a boss to water, but you cannot make him higher. So if you know of any good fairy who might give away positions on the executive level, just have him wave that magic wand before I pass into the great beyond, the place where I sincerely hope and pray they have no such word as resume. <laughs> and now, I once again, I want to take this opportunity to thank our guests on Poet to Poet today. That's uh, Cynthia, bad girl, bad girl, bad girl, Andrews, <laughs> who was... Very good yes, well, <laughs> <laughs> I, I have heard the report. <laughs> also, uh, Cynthia is, is knocking around the circuit, and you can see her, and you can also see Ad Jerry, his guitar, his voice, and, uh, and his street clothes, I've been corrected <laughs> in uh, that respect. So, once again, I want to thank everybody for putting up with us for another installment of Poet the Poet. And there's a ringing in my ears. I, should, uh, I have to have that taken care of. So, thanks one and all for being with us.